Hi, this is Doug Shields with Clear One's Technical Training Department, and today we thought we'd like to show you about the different colors of cross points and what they do. If you look at this matrix, you see that we have blue, yellow, green cross points. We can also have brown cross points. In fact, the first four inputs are mic or line inputs, and of those mic or line inputs, we can choose between a yellow echo canceled gated cross point, a blue echo canceled non-gated cross point, or a brown pre-AEC and gated cross point. Now what do these do and why would we use them? Today we're going to focus on the yellow cross point and how we might use it. And when we do that we'd like to uh, look at the circuit that uh, this goes through. To do that I'm going to show you a different slide that illustrates what portions of the circuit each of the cross points go through. Here we see a depiction of the microphone circuits going from a microphone to the matrix and then from an input to an output. If we connect input 1 to output 2, we'll follow the yellow signal path and we'll see that it goes from the mic through the gain stage, through the acoustic echo canceller and nonlinear processor, through the noise canceller, through the mutes, through the filters, through the AGC and ALC. AGC is automatic gain control, ALC is automatic level control, and the automatic mixer or the gating parameters. Going from input 1 to output 2 takes the longest amount of time, which is 18 milliseconds. However, that latency is needed and really not noticed because the yellow cross point is used when we route a signal from an input a mic that needs to go to a far end source outside of the room or outside of real time if it's time shifted or place shifted using the yellow cross point it does have the echo canceller circuit it does have the noise canceller circuit it does have the automatic level control circuit all of those help to get a nice clean signal to the far end the mic can still be routed using blue and brown cross points to the other destinations that you might have using other outputs but we do need a yellow cross point anytime we route the mic outside of the room or outside of real time. This was by contrast to what we saw with the brown cross point, which was inside the room in real time, and it skips the noise canceller, it skips the acoustic echo canceller and nonlinear processor, and that brown cross point also skipped the automatic level control. Thanks so much. Good programming.